And good news for campers. State Parks Rangers just announced Refugio could reopen as soon as Saturday. However, it will be at least three weeks for El Capitan campsites to reopen. As the Sherpa fire burns, campers are having to set up tents somewhere else. Sean Larson joins us live at Kachimo Lake. And Sean, you found out that this wasn't necessarily the number one option for campers. Hey guys, that's right. It was a great day for camping out here on Lake Kachuma, but yeah, that's right. Not their number one choice. A lot of them telling me that they planned on camping at the beach, but had to find an alternative because of the Sherpa fire. Oh yeah, we're super disappointed. We were looking forward to camping on the beach for the first time. Misty Coronado and her husband just bought their trailer a year ago. They drove it down from Bakersfield to camp out. So we were going to come down the beach and stay like in Carpinteria or Refugio um, or El Capitan, but with the fires and the freeway keeps closing, it just we didn't think it was safe, so we came up here to Lake Kachuma. It was a nice day, but some of these campers, like the Coronados, say they prefer the beach water than the nearly dried out lake. <laughs> we came all this way to camp somewhere we could pretty much camp at home. The drought is taking a toll on the lake. It's down to 14% capacity. At full capacity, it sits at 753 feet. It's down to 663 feet. That's 90 feet down. It really narrowed down the camping for everybody when they all got evacuated. Tamara Kimry and her husband traveled up from Orange County and were hoping to enjoy the Central Coast Beach campgrounds, but opted for Lake Kachuma, where she used to come as a kid. I used to fish right here. That's the other scary thing about the fires is we already don't have any resources. It's the season though. Unfortunately in California we deal with this every summer, but it's so bad that it's so close to the beach. That's, that really is too bad. And you can see over my shoulder here just how low the water level is here. A precious resource, a prime example of this drought that we're in. Reporting live at Lake Kachuma, Sean Larson, let's toss it back to you guys. Hey Sean, thanks so much. And we did just learn that most